they are intent simply on blowing up the party, which they are doing, and this Congress. They do not care. They you make don't like point. McCarthy, then shouldn't they have a solid candidate in the wings? Why don't they, they keep change it? Why don't they nominate Matt Gates? Matt Gates has been on the floor all the time. He's one of them. He uh, was the original holdout. He should be, the, and he has made it very clear. He will not, in a million years, vote for Kevin McCarthy. Hey, put Matt Gates up today. Let's see what happens to him. How many votes is he going to get? There have been twenty. Th These two hundred and twelve Democrats are going to vote for Hakeem Jeffries every single time. He is a historic candidate for them. They are not going to cleave off under any circumstance. I assure you that if Democrats join up to elect a moderate Republican, I will resign from the House of Representatives. That is how certain I am. I can assure okay. your viewers that won't happen. I'm betting on uh, my vote for Kevin McCarthy under almost any circumstance. But it's important to note that all of those so bullet points personal, you just then. presented. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Hold on, oh, oh. hold on, hold on. Wait, that's personal then. You, no, you no, just no. made this very principled point. No, no. You can't have it both ways. You can't say, I am, I'm a man of principle and I believe in X, Y, and Z, but if he gives me X, Y, and Z, I'm not going to vote for him. Why is in focus now. Popcorn. Blankets and alcohol. And we have Twitter receipts from some of that. Absolutely. Absolutely we do, Harris. And it's like I almost struck a nerve there. If it wasn't true, why did they get so offended? I'm, I just can't figure that one out. But as, AO, as you said, AOC actually did uh, prove my point in grabbing drinks yesterday. But that's beside the point. You know, the Democrats want Republicans to be divided because they know that the greatest weapon that we have against the Biden regime is unity. Tonight, Kevin McCarthy's I just lost the 11th round trying to be speaker. And it's funny how we're supposed to feel about this. We're all supposed to be highly upset, outraged, appalled, on the verge of tears. I think a lot of the emotions are, though, Tucker, that we only have one third of the government. All of our dreams to stop this madness are now invested in the House. If the party had won more seats, he probably would have had an easy time sailing into the speakership. But despite the huge sums of money that he helped raise for the party, there wasn't a red wave. So here we are.